welcome back to my channel. My name is Emma, also known as Maiden in the Moment, and this here is my friend, Mrs. Moon Heaven, also known as Jada. <laughs> Thank, Thank you for watching. Please, please subscribe and like and comment, and comment below. below. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> uh, so today I have Jada on my channel. Earlier we posted on our stories asking for questions, hot takes, and assumptions about us. So both of us posted on our stories and we got quite a few responses. Quite a few. Unfortunately, we're not gonna have time to go through both of them. We're just gonna pick the best ones. So like, don't be offended if we don't think that yours is the best. <laughs> yeah, so we're gonna pick the funny ones. So if you're funny, then we'll Good read for yours. You. <laughs> but yeah, so we're just gonna go through and, and react, respond when necessary. Boo when necessary. Boo when necessary. We're just gonna get into it. Uh, uh, okay, let's start off easy. Favorite type of bread? Baguette. Is that like, is that an answer? Yeah, no, that's, a, that's an answer, that's an answer. Oh, and this is by Miria Likes Ramen. This is, baguette is your answer. Baguette, like French baguette, is that? That's a, that's a, that's a like good a, answer. Oh, like a crispy on the outside, Ooh. especially when they're warm. Yeah. Like, it's like a little mushy on the inside. It's like that but one in a good way. Ratatouille. The, the episode. episode. <laughs> Where she's like, not the... Not the smell, not the something, the sound. And she goes, it. Yeah. Yeah, I love that episode. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite type of bread, I actually like, don't know the answer. Um, but yours is really fast. I like something with, um, I like something that is also like soft on the inside. I, you know what, I guess I really love, I really love a sourdough bread. But like I don't think that's my favorite. Like I want to say like a nice, like a sweet, like a sweeter oh. bread. Like I like I like a lot of like rolls and stuff. But like I love the in. I guess I guess I would say the inside of a sourdough bread. Sourdough is good. I feel like yeah. that's such a distinct flavor. Like that's a good. It is because like go, it's good with with sweet and it's good yeah. with savory. Would you rather only crochet out of wet noodles or doll hair? <laughs> <laughs> that's by, from Theo Teddy Moon. <laughs> Uh, doll hair. I think doll hair too. At least you could keep it. Yeah, you like, could like disgusting. you could probably do s cool stuff with it. It's gonna be so like you can't wear anything. Mm, you can wash it. It's itchy. How do you know? What if it's like soft doll I'm sorry, hair? Have you had dolls? Not in a while. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but doll Not hair. that I recall. Yeah, I Not choose doll I hair. Okay, thank you. Favorite music video. Go first on this one. <laughs> um. Okay. I have a few, so I'm gonna pick one because I I love music videos. Oh, I think one of them is Paparazzi by Lady Gaga. I think that really That's did it for me. That's a good one. Yeah, hers are good. Yeah, like, I love a story. Yeah, because I think like when I was a kid and I watched that one, I was like, oh. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to go with You Belong with Me. That's also a good. Taylor one. Swift. Yeah, she has some good music videos. Yeah, but like. That one is just, I, that was like probably one of the first music videos I yeah, ever saw. Yeah. And I, it just spoke to me. Like the window. Yeah. That I like she has stories. Like yeah. I really like the blank space video. I think that also yeah. got me really good when yeah. I watched that. And her all too well 10 minute one is so good. Oh, yeah. that's not even really a music video though. That's in a separate category. No, it, it is. Okay, then I choose that. Wow. <laughs> Actually, actually, it's not anymore. <laughs> I choose that one. <laughs> oh, that was from Josie underscore authors. Um, non conformist oath asked, What is the worst thing you've ever crocheted? The worst thing I ever crocheted was the first project that I made, which, like, I know that's a boring answer, Boo. but it was I was following one of Kelsey's. Oh, really? video patterns yeah oh wow and it like totally wasn't her fault i just like didn't know how to count <laughs> and i couldn't figure i was making one of the bralettes uh -huh. and for the cups like they're very easy if you know how to do it mm -hmm. and you know what stitch to go into mm -hmm. but like i had literally i made maybe like one row of single crochet and then i was like i'm, I'm ready. ready to follow a pattern <laughs> because i'm delusional <laughs> <laughs> so i tried to follow that pattern and i had to unravel it a bunch of times you have to find a picture now like, i don't have any pictures ooh. i know because i was so embarrassed that i didn't take any i should have though oh, i messed up again 
Emma, if you're watching this, look away. <laughs> look away. <laughs> Jada's butchering your I pattern. Am, I am. Do you think what it's going to matter? What is this pattern for? The, the, the Norma, Norma Jean, Jean romper. romper. And um, Jada's going to finish this before the deadline. Yeah, just put a blood. Which is... In two weeks. In... I thought it was in like five days. In two weeks. In two weeks. Like blue. I mean, whole, this is the whole time it's like pixelated. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this is just a for fun I project. Mean, <laughs> this is just my own thing. I'm yeah. also not way behind on a pattern test that's not due tomorrow. It's not due tomorrow yeah. at like all. A month. Yeah. A month at least. Um, the only thing I ever crocheted was uh, <laughs> the the bunny for Zach. <laughs> No further questions. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No I'll have to. Questions. I'll put a picture of that in. Yeah, no further questions. That really. I'll put the whole TikTok. Yeah, in. this whole yeah, yeah. This whole thing. That's yeah. <laughs> no, you I, win. Mars makes asks, "What's your favorite type of potato?" And I'm gonna guess like what potato form. Yeah, yeah. We talked about this yesterday. Yeah. To, to an extent, I, I talked about it yesterday. I did not, <laughs> but I I love potatoes. Me too. My choice, I think, would have to be like oven roasted. Yeah, oven with roasted. like a bunch of spices, oh, where wow. it's like where it's like crispy on the outside. This is a theme, I guess, for what I like to eat: crispy on the outside, soft in the middle. Like okay. when you boil yeah. the potatoes beforehand. Oh yeah. And yeah. then they're like, it's like mashed potatoes yeah. inside, oh, but the outside ooh. has like a shell. I think I'm gonna make that soon. Actually, that sounds yeah. Amazing. Wait, I'm gonna make that tonight. That sounds amazing. I I'm gonna say mashed potatoes, like a nice creamy mashed potato. I make fucking like, mm. good mashed potatoes. Um, like really good mashed potato. and that's you were talking about this because I was eat them with a with a, with a spatula. rubber spatula yeah because you know you pe- yeah people say like oh who eats mashed potatoes with a spoon it's like why wouldn't you just shovel yeah and also scrape with a spatula yeah but that's something I will eat like until I'm sick I can eat any potato until I'm sick but mashed potatoes <laughs> like I will go for it yeah. yeah no with the oven roasted potatoes I can legitimately eat like two full potatoes yeah in yeah one that's sitting. the thing like, easy. Potatoes are so easy to just do that. They're way. so good. Yeah. Great question. Good question. Really good question. Okay. <laughs> Espressionel asks, would you rather have to douse every one of your projects in apple cider vinegar and never wash it again, or have to wear an itchy mohair sweater to bed every night? That's a really good one. I think itchy sweater. Yeah, mine's mine's apple cider vinegar. Mm-hmm. Like I'm, I'll just smell like kombucha, but like my eczema will be so bad. Yeah. Or I just won't wear my things out, I guess. Yeah. Actually, like, I don't know. I would just I don't have, have very sensitive perfume. skin, so I think I think I could be okay. I think it would it would kill get me. to me. Oh. No, I mean <laughs> I yeah, I would kill die. you. But I think that it would like bother me for yeah, sure. Yeah. But I think I would be fine. No, I sleep naked, so like I literally cannot do that. Mm, you know, I have yeah. such sensory issues. Yeah. Yeah, I know. I'd rather die. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, especially also ask if someone. I think it's supposed to say, would you rather have to take a shit in someone's mouth on live television, or never knit again? Because I would never knit again. Like, I would never knit again. Yeah. Yeah. That like, is, that would be unfortunate. Yeah. But like, I, I would not be able to do it. Yeah, I wouldn't be able. Like, like I, I don't think I could even, I don't think I physically could, like, under pressure. Yeah, no. Like, <laughs> I, w- like I think my, my sphincter would go inside itself. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I don't so. even, like, pee, like, not in, like not yeah. on a toilet. Yeah, yeah. Like, unless I'm ha- like unless I'm in the wilderness and I have yeah. to and make sense of and it. And even then, it, like, takes me a while me to, like, too. like and, courage. And to get used to it. Yeah. Like, after the first time, it's whatever. Maybe yeah. that's what it will be like after we poop in someone's mouth on live television. Yeah, after the after first the time, first time yeah. it's not that bad. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you know, when we mind. do that. <laughs> <laughs> that's my answer. This is good. Melly's Menagerie asks, what part of the dino nuggets do you eat first? The head. Me too. Or the tail. It depends. Sometimes I feel like mm. crazy. Yeah, because sometimes you pick it up by the head. Yeah. And eat by the t- I almost always do the head. Me, I think first. me too. No head? No head. Dade Maid asked, what kind of gaze are you? In parentheses, aesthetic. <laughs> I'm definitely big. Uh, it's you're a, like. I'm big shirt, little pants, or little pants, big yeah. shirt type of, ga- type of bi. You're yeah. also, yeah, you're like earrings bi girl. Oh, I am earrings bi girl. Yeah. It, like, I feel like that's all very under the same umbrella, like mm-hmm. colorful earrings. Colorful, yeah. Very much like art, like by art. RC. Yeah. Yeah. But like in my overalls and everything. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Um, Good question. I don't know. I feel like I know mine, but I don't know how to like put it into words. Like, what would you say for me? I say like the most fucked up shit right now. <laughs> <laughs> I I don't know. I feel like it's also like it's like another type of like artsy gay but like i mean it is like but you know what because you're not a theater gay 
you're no. absolutely not a theater I'm nerd. like, I am adjacent. You're adjacent, but I don't. But it's, not. it's like there's no. I think it, opera I, gays are a different thing, I think it and plays, that's not me. I think it plays a part into like how much of an like how you portray your art self, but in yeah. a very small way. Yeah. Like you have a very specific look, and I you're the, kind of like a thrifty gay. Yeah. You're definitely a thrifty gay. Yeah. I feel like I used to be more like colorful by girl crafty. Yeah, but, but now right I'm like now, yeah. artsy, non-binary twink. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah that might be <laughs> like, it. Like, like not because, butch. No, no, it's not because it's because like you still like like I feel like you're the the um way you accessorize. Yeah, helps, like, feminize. Yeah, a lot of, like because and also like everything, everything about very... the way I speak and act. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> but like if you just, like the pictures that I took of you from yesterday, you yeah. wouldn't think that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, no, I think I think that's yeah. Yeah, that one's tough. It's tough because it's like, I feel like you there you could find a match for me. Like there's I, I a lot so of too, but we just correlations. Can't, I can't like verbalize it. Me neither. Yeah. Someone else answer that. What kind of gay are we? Get a load of this guy. <laughs> uh, <laughs> if you could only knit with one yarn for the rest of your life, which yarn would you choose? Easy, bulky merino. Like one brand or one kind of yarn? I'm guessing one kind of yarn. I would say like a worsted weight. Oh. Um, I thought you meant like style. Okay, yeah, okay, that's bulky. what I'm saying. Yeah, okay. bulky. Like weight, I would say worsted. Bulky, mm. I like, but mm. I can't do all the color work I want to do mm -hmm. with bulky. But mm -hmm. I can make it work. Yeah. And then, yeah, merino. merino. If I can only pick one, merino. Yeah. Merino. Absolutely, that shit's so. I know. Nice. I'm a little bit of a yarn snob about knitting. Me too. Yeah. I absolutely. Well, you am. were just saying that. Yeah, right? I yeah. actually like because I've only knit with like really nice yarn. Yeah. So like I've only done like really soft cotton mm -hmm. and merino. Yeah. Um, so I am a yarn snob and I will make fun of you for using acrylic yarn. I've never used acrylic <laughs> yarn. I only use natural fibers, um, <laughs> hand dyed yarn. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, if you could make anything out of yarn, no matter how impractical or unrealistic, what would you make? That's a really good question. That is a great question. I, maybe this is not like Im ridiculous enough, but I would make a hammock. Whoa, that's a like good Like, that could answer. theoretically, like, I could do that. That's a really like, good Like, hammocks answer. are made out of, yeah. like, it's no, macrame, I, I was gonna, whatever. I was going to ask, I mean, I was going to answer the same way. Like, something I absolutely will not make, but yeah. I would love yeah. to make if, if it wasn't impractical for yeah. me to do so. Oh, another thing is, like, uh, like a suit. Oh, Wouldn't that yeah. be cool? I was going to say, like, a big flowy dress. Mm. Like, with, like, yarn yes. like this. Yes, But, like, so like long formal like, wear it's yeah. the kind of thing that i theoretically could do yeah, exactly. right like so exactly. i don't know if that necessarily yeah. is what the person was asking yeah. but like i realistically probably will never yeah, do that exactly and like i want to make something like like how selkie dresses are yeah but like in, but like something with like a beautiful stitch like yeah i will never do that no. i like i'm telling you right now it's no. not gonna happen Aww. oh sorry okay wait. <laughs> that was from renegade eclipse 48 um hyperfocus.net asks Memory that feels like warm sun and smooth jazz. And I love that. That's a, That's a great really question. good one. You know what felt like that, though? Our day at the park last week. That's yeah. what felt like. We had a really good day at the park. But that's we barely did. a memory. But I would like to say that yeah. that's exactly what it felt like. Honestly, also the the crochet oh. trip, that one day where we were outside. And yeah. it was like the perfect yeah. weather, yeah. super sunny. Like, that's, those are, that's a memory that I have like, with you together. One. But also, I feel like I have a lot from like... So I have two other like very specific ones. One is at El Matador Beach in like kind of Santa Monica, Malibu mm -hmm. area. I had this like perfect sunset picnic with my Ooh, friends. Oh yeah. We got like the perfect snacks. We had just like one little glass of rose mm -hmm. and a strawberry. And it was, it was beautiful. Second one is um, I studied abroad in Heidelberg. Was and that? the house in Germany. Oh. And the that house was like up on a hill, uh -huh. like near the castle. So like every oh, sunset or sunrise, wow. you could see like out over the whole city. I'll yeah. show you pictures of Heidelberg later. Uh -huh. It's beautiful. It's a gorgeous, that absolutely awesome. stunning place. I'm glad you answered first because now I know mine. Yeah. I, I, you answered so fast. Because <laughs> um, definitely the crochet trip was yeah. like that, like meeting each other for the first time. And also it was like just like a perfect match and like perfect weather. It was quiet. The town was perfect. Yeah. Was uh, yeah. Everyone was so nice. Such a good crowd. Yeah. Like that whole trip. 
Um, and then another one would be the first time I went on a uh, vacation with my partner when we started dating. Because um, it was like one of those like, well, we're going next month. Do you want to go? And we were only dating for a little bit. We were best friends for a really long time. And like, it was also like, there were mountains everywhere. It was in New Hampshire. And like, our, the backyard was... Um, was just like you could see down and you saw a river and you saw it going back up you sent pictures of this yes right? yeah yes, it was a beautiful a-frame yeah. and like we would I, I don't wake up early but we would wake up for sunset I would stay late sunrise. so we could look at the start yeah sunrise um because that's because we were facing the sunrise and then uh at night like we would look at the stars and like me and all his friends would like just like look up or whatever it was so beautiful um and then also um, what was my other one? I had another one in my head. Oh, my uh, one year for my birthday, me and my friends did a trip uh, to Pennsylvania, and we just stayed like we just like stayed also in like a, a nice house, and it was so beautiful. But I think specifically when we went kayaking, we just did like a two-hour thing on the kayak, and we would just like go out and just lie there in the sun. Like it was just so relaxing, but like us all together like we all would like rode together at one point like we t I tied I was like I'm gonna get one for myself like I'm gonna do it myself and then I tied it up to Dre's and so and then he's <laughs> rowing and then somebody else tied up to mine so he's like pulling <laughs> all of us and then we just like relaxing like even looking back at the photos like we feel like, like warm calm. sun and smooth jazz yeah. yeah that's such a beautiful way to word the question too that, uh, really. you really like in our heads yeah so the world of Megan asks if you only had to use one color yarn for the rest of your life what color would it be and I think we have to get specific because it's going to be so easy for me to say pink. Yeah, because I would say purple probably or pink. I think I think I'm going to say um, I think I'm actually going to not choose pink because although I wear a lot of pink and I like it, I think that I would choose like that bright yellow, that bright green yellow that I always wear. Oh, because yeah. then at least that like is, I would always yeah. have it yeah. and it would always be cool. I think I actually would probably choose blue mm -hmm. because use a lot of I. Blue. But what kind of blue? I use a lot of blue, like this blue okay that's a good one that's like a good one. i specifically dyed this tank top oh. to be the, like one of my favorite shades that's of blue. a perfect blue yeah good again good again good, 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 good question good 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 <laughs> okay really easy one five four one nine two seven four seven f goes are you girlfriends <laughs> no yes <laughs> yes next question <laughs> <laughs> yo <laughs> <laughs> Every hand asks, rate your fingers from one to five aka what are your fave fingers and why <laughs> I was gonna say one. one. Um, also, because I could do this. I'm like, yeah. if you if you didn't have a pointer finger, you could like do things like this, you know. And That's I'm, true. Yeah. 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 I would say one, two. two. What oh. about your thumbs? No, this is th thumb is three. I need these. Two. Okay, gay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, hold on. I'm gonna bleep this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. One, one, two, two three, three for me. Oh. Three. Interesting. Yeah. Okay. And then four. Yeah, four or five, I, I guess. I could do without my pinky, I, I guess I could technically do without my pinky. But, like, what am I doing with my ring finger? Wait, when I'm crocheting, I'm oh, wait, to think. Oh, wait. Actually, good question. Or, sorry, knitting. Excuse me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Yeah, I guess I would have to do my tension on my middle finger then. But that's doable, too. Yeah, I would figure it out. Yeah, but I would like, figure it out. But I my pinky's I don't actually not doing pinky. anything. My but pinky's she's so cute. There. Yeah. Good Did question. She? Yeah, that's a great question. <laughs> <laughs> That's a really good question. <laughs> oh, are y'all okay? Woven by Witzel asks, are y'all's kneecaps chewy or crunchy? Crunchy. <laughs> um, Shannon asks, what type? What would you do if you swap bodies for a day? I would do. Um, I would do that kick thing. Oh, thank you. I'll put a video in. Yeah. Do you want to see something I've been working on? Fuck. Wait, no, that one wasn't very high. Fuck. Something I'm working on. <laughs> I would also dance. I feel like you have like this fluidity in your body oh God, that I just so I can't emulate myself in mm -hmm. my current body. Thank you so much because I really do feel like a noodle a lot. Like I feel. But that's what it is. Yeah, like, I feel I have a very specific dance like style. Skill set. Yeah. 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 Um, and I move like a blue balloon. Yeah, yeah. exactly. <laughs> <laughs> like it's very comedic, you know? Yeah. That but I, I like that. I feel Thank like you. I don't have I don't have the moves mm. to be able to like it's I hard, can't I don't have any know? funny dances. Like when I dance it's just it's just kinda like oh <laughs> Ooh, like don't look. Uh, <laughs> I would definitely like I feel like I would make a lot of like videos like on TikTok, like <laughs> 
Like, I feel like the way that I would make, I would make the funniest jokes. Like, I would just, like, go pranks galore, you know? Like, I don't know what type of pranks, but I would definitely pull some. Because no one would be expecting it if it was me. No, because I wouldn't get blamed for it. Yeah, you know? And I would make it, like, really easy to get caught later on, too, so that you'd have to explain yourself (laughs) I'd have to, like, deal with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. but nothing, like, terrible, but, like... Just, like, funny. Yeah, like, where's my left shoe? You know, yeah. and but like I would also like probably like sneak picture. Like I would take Polaroids of you, like <laughs> like sit, like the bag, the, the money bag. sign. <laughs> 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 um, I think you. I'm gonna give you a suggestion for what else you should do mm-hmm. if you were in my body for one day. Okay, go ahead. You should sing opera. <gasps> it feels. You oh, don't even know how good it feels. Such a good. It that's feels so good. good. That's actually yeah. really good. It would feel really good. Yeah, that's so true. I think. I'm um, so yeah, I think that I would That's such a good idea Like I would make videos too But like I would like only Like I think that I would like Read your patterns But like <laughs> Out loud Like <laughs> sing it Like you, you would know? like share my <laughs> like, property I would like go Please into do not your share bank in account And, part. <laughs> and, <laughs> and like, transfer all your money to me <laughs> But I would do the same to you Yeah, good luck with that uh, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you good luck with that <laughs> You would pay off my student loan. Yeah, I would pay off your student loan. <laughs> um, <laughs> Um, I would definitely like if sing. anyone wants to pay off my student if loans, anybody wants to switch bodies just to pay off our student <laughs> loans um, yeah that's actually a really good idea but I think yeah. I would make a lot of TikToks like make just like saying silly things you know yeah like maybe like start some drama that would be fun yeah for you I think for me um, I also would knit because I feel like I want to mm. knit like really fast yeah, yeah it I does think. that also feels good it's yeah. like the same thing as oh you should roller skate thing. oh no I <laughs> roller skate myself oh yeah you do I fucking hockey. flips you do flips. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know you played hockey. I did. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, okay. Don't roll escape then. Um, what else can I do? <laughs> uh, oh, I would juggle. Yeah, I mean, I'll practice before then. <laughs> so you can enjoy it more. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Um, um, you can yeah. play some, like, warm-up chords on the piano. That feels pretty good. Oh, I would love to do that. Yeah, you can do, like, a double backflip into, like, a handstand oh yeah you can do that right yeah yeah um <laughs> i'll also play ragtime yeah, yeah. <laughs> on the piano oh, God, just I the wish. maple leaf rag just the maple leaf rag so okay, okay this that. is basically it's a to-do list of things we need to perfect before, before we, we yeah okay. that's fine <laughs> okay. if you were a soup what type of soup would you be and why which is a different question than like what soup do you like so that's yeah, a hard one that is tough okay mine would have to have like a lot of things in it I was going to say, for me, I was going to say, like, um, some kind of bean soup. Mm, bean. Because I like eating beans. Mm-hmm. Uh, and I feel like there's a lot, there's a lot going on, but when you put it all together, it's, like, good. Mm, yeah. Yeah. There's a lot going, that's a good answer. Yeah. Because um, I'm trying to think of something, like, fun with, like, a lot of different things, but, like, it wouldn't be, like, a minestrone because that's too, like... I feel like I'm not a minestrone, you no. know? I'm like an oops all berries. <laughs> that's what I that's mean, your cereal soup. is, yes, a soup, right? Cereal is a soup. I think I would I be think oops all berries. That. Yeah. I would definitely be oops all berries. Oops. Oops. All berries. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's a great answer. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> uh, here's here's one. Melinda.wisdom. Best mask crochet garments and best ways to practice tension. Love you both. Because I'm going to mm. say I really want to make a shirt like this. Yeah. And, and every, I've been seeing a lot of those. And that's yes. like... I have two. The I really one. like all of the like open stitch work ones. Yeah, um, I'm gonna make one soon. Yeah, I made one, but it's like all half double crochets, mm-hmm. and it's nice. Yeah, I, I think like I'm it. gonna do a loose tension double yeah. crochet one. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I feel like I can't think of many off the top of my head, but I'll put some. Yeah, on there's the, oh, the the Cause the shell stitch one. I have I have one. That's a, a shell stitch one. Oh, um, Grace made one recently. Did you see that? Like a commission for Coachella. Oh, that one was so I really cool. like that one. Uh, you go from like the armpits. Yeah, it's like a out. hexagon, right? Yeah, yeah. But it's great. It's like granny stitch. Mm-hmm. So I feel like that. Yeah, that's that one's one. good. Um, I have one. You I feel like some. One. I have some mask. Yeah. Some masky ish mm-hmm. mm-hmm. patterns. Yeah. For Maybe sure. I should make a video on like. Yeah, that's a good one. A list of, of, patterns to recommend. Yes. But I'll put some on the screen. Yes. You're on a deserted island and can only use nature as yarn. What millimeter hook and needle do you bring? That's a good one. Wow. Because, like, what would you... Like, I'm thinking, like, we would have to use, like, the most... The most practical thing would be, like, big leaves. And, like, if you rip them up, 
That's so funny because I was thinking like grass. Like little <laughs> tiny grass? Because how would yeah. you, but how would. Well, like, like long grass. But like, oh. well, it depends where you are. I'm imagining that I'm somewhere with like long grass. Like, like really long? Grass. Oh. But I don't know, like. Because I'm thinking that I can like rip long leaves, like mm. banana leaves if I rip it up into small ones. Because in that case, I would say maybe like. You can make baskets. Like, I would say maybe like a mm. 10. Because then you can make baskets. You can make. You can make them thicker if you wanted to. Yeah. Like a nine or a ten, because then and then you can make a roof. Like you know, like instead of like weaving it together, yeah. you could make a really tight stitch. Because I was thinking, I was originally thinking like five. Yeah. But you see what my know. head's at. But I'm thinking you're not really like you could make clothes, but you're not gonna wear a grass thing. No. You're gonna you're, want. You're right. It's a hat. Be, yeah. Yeah. A basket, something for water. Yeah. A roof. I would say then I would bring. A food, uh, a food thing, or something. I would bring an to. eight. Yeah, I think because that could kind of go. You could mm, either make way. smaller things like a hat. Yeah, but you could also like theoretically make a roof. Yeah, um, and then needles, maybe ten millimeter needles. Yeah, the needles would have to be yeah. bigger. Um, yeah, there's no way I'm bringing like. I feel like maybe even bigger. Maybe yeah. like fifteen. I don't know. I don't feel like knitting needles would do me any good in the wild. I, don't I think, think so I think crochet would. I would I, rather bring two crochet hooks. Yeah, me too. Wait, is like it, a is fifteen? It both? I think it's hook and needle. Oh, hook! I oh, I think hook slash needle either yeah. or. But I don't think you get two hooks. I think you get yeah, one you hook get one or hook or and two, two needles. Yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. I guess maybe a nine because I think still think you can make a nine with, uh, a, like a hat. Yeah. But like, I don't want to be miserable making like a roof. Yeah. Yeah, and I feel like you could also like you can artificially change your tension as well like you can That's make true. things yeah. bigger and just mm-hmm. use the hook to like pull yeah it exactly exactly um oh we never answered that person's question that was like what how do you improve your tension oh that's the same one. Oh wait no, no you're no, right no, you're, you're right, back, right, right back. but i think for that i would say just you just have to practice like jada is currently doing a little practice tension exercise with um straight needles Mm -hmm. to get better like just making swatches Mm -hmm. and making like big projects honestly like i feel like my first few sweaters the tension was really weird Mm -hmm. but after i made like three sweaters my tension was fine yeah because like you spend so much time just doing the same stitch over and over again that's true same that eventually you like get the hang of it and also like better grips like yeah I think like my five millimeter hook tension is like not as tight as it when I don't use like this. Yeah. Like I need to because it's because like some I don't know some people have tension problems with bulk yarn, but me for example, like if yeah. I'm using yarn that I'm not used to, my tension's like all messed up because yeah I don't have as much control of it. So like when you have at least control of like your small hook, then you're able to like work on your tension and also go slower because sometimes you want to go X Games mode, but you shouldn't. <laughs> <laughs> you can't always go. You can't always mode. go. You know what they always say. That's what I always say. Yeah, I do always say that. Nice. Knitting slash crochet technique you refuse to try or hate. Double knitting for you. Yeah, double knitting for me. I'm I'm good on that actually. <laughs> um. Refuse to try. I I think there's nothing I would not try once. Good for you. I would try everything once. Good. Um, I think I would also, but like something I think I would know I wouldn't like would be, um, it would definitely be, you know what? Cable knitting looks really hard to me. It's really easy. Don't tell me that. You would, it's, you would be fine. You really would. Well, it looks hard. (laughs) You just like put stitches on a little extra tiny needle and then you knit around it. I think those people are making a TikTok. Aw. Good for them. Aww. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> People make TikTok. Um, ugh. Ugh. Disgusting. Get them away from me. Yeah. I don't know what else I, I wouldn't do or like that I don't like. I'm like, I am, this is not like really my answer, but I feel like Tunisian crochet. I was going like to think once that. Once I started yeah. getting into knitting, I was like, I don't really have the desire yeah. to learn. I'm not against it. But I think but I, I would I would like it. Yeah. But I don't think, it also takes a long time. Yeah. So you might as well knit. Exactly. I was going to say that as well. Yeah. But I was like. like I'm not, I'm really not against it. And I've done yeah. it before, but not for a whole project. Yeah. Um, I thought about it at one point and Aiden and Brooke were like, you would hate it, Jada. So maybe that's <laughs> the answer. Yeah. Like, Jada, don't they do decided. it. They decided. Stephanie's Forza asked, is Euphoria dead after season two? Um, oh, is, is Euphoria dead after season two was kind of a bust? Yes or yes? <laughs> yeah. 
I, I think n- so. I've never seen it, actually. Oh, okay. I think, yeah. But I, that's what I've heard on Twitter. I think, yeah. I think season I think one so. was a beautiful, amazing masterpiece. And, like, all the things that made it, like, so cool. Like, it was like watching a play sometimes, you know? And then they just made it a play. Basically, a lot of the... They didn't even. They did, like, a specific type of play in the second in the second season. I don't know. But the first season was beautiful, like, because they did, like, stage stuff. Like, mm. there was one point that was so beautiful. Like, it was Rue and her girlfriend. And, like, they were, like, somewhere. And then they put a bed behind them and put the blanket over... Like, it was like oh, a, like yeah. a stage show. Yeah. And it was so beautiful. And they would do things like that that made it really cool. And then a lot of that went away. And I think mm. that, like, I don't know exactly what happened. But, like, allegedly there was so much going on behind the, behind the scenes that just made it, like, impossible to, like... I don't know what was happening. But, like, I didn't love season two. I thought it... Like, I was watching it at one point because it felt like a chore. Like, as it felt oh. like a chore. But I just wanted to finish it. Yeah. Yeah. No, I get, like, I get like that too. Yeah. I'm like, I have to know. Yeah. Maybe watch season one. And then just stop okay. there. You don't have yeah. to watch season two, you know? Yeah. You really don't. That's true. That's true. Just enjoy season one. Some, yeah. some shows should be like that. Some yeah. shows, I think, here's my hot yes. take. I think a lot of shows should just be one season and then end it there. Like, it doesn't have to be more than one. I think some things would just be good lives one season. I think some need more than one. No, me too. But I think that, that some... some just need one. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I will say, though, I feel like there's an interesting like dichotomy where I feel like really good shows where I want to see more seasons get mm-hmm. canceled really early yeah mm-hmm. and then shows where I'm like we have done enough yeah we don't need any more get like way too many seasons yeah I feel like I would have loved one more season of succession yeah oh someone had a succession question I didn't know you watched oh Melanie. yeah okay no I I'll, I was gonna yeah. say we should answer that one. okay but um, um Melanie was I, out watching that today actually it's so good yeah. I haven't seen the most recent episode which is the finale mm. so it's, oh, it's right. done now oh. but honestly i feel like they could have done more yeah. there's still there's yeah. still more to do with that show but i'm glad that they finished well i mean hopefully it ends yeah. well we find out who the succession the mm-hmm. successor is mm-hmm. uh but then i okay i have been watching yellow jackets too mm-hmm. which i don't know if you have seen yeah. I'll, I'll tell you more about it later mm-hmm. you don't need to yeah um. uh but I think they're going to have too many seasons because they have that. already been signed that. on for like four or something. And this is season two and it's getting to the point where I'm like, that's what happened. We got to wrap Lost. this up. Yeah. Yeah. It was what yeah. happened with Lost. And then like even the guys, like the, the writers didn't want it to happen. Yeah. But that's why I think my favorite, like one of my favorite shows is um, The Good Place because the way that they did it. Yes. He yes. did it. But he ended. It could have yes. been they more. Said, they said we'll do more. And he said no. Exactly. Yes. Like he did it Say, for the story. I, yes. And like anything that you could have guessed. He, he covered it yeah. before you could guess it. Yeah. Any time, like, that it might have ran too long. Like, you're like, maybe this is going to go on a for a while. Show. It never did. There yeah. were twists. There were, like, season finales in the middle of seasons. Yeah. And that, yeah. yeah, That's, yeah oh, yeah, my yeah, God. Yeah. I want to rewatch that you now. Should, you should. That's uh, one of those shows you Breaking should Breaking Bad, too. Breaking Bad. I think yes. that that went on. That was, like, the perfect, perfect. length of time. Yep. Um, Better Call Saul, mm-hmm. also. I didn't watch that yet. Bojack yeah. Horseman. Like, even mm, that. Like, yeah, it, yeah. the storyline ended perfectly. Yeah. You know? Yeah overstay as well. Mm-hmm. Good story. Yeah. Okay, so what succession crochet by Kiki asked what succession ca- what, what succession <laughs> character would you be and why? You can answer for me yeah, and I, I won't have, have to. Any but I, I was like, oh, we should ask this question, but I feel like it's hard because there are no there's not really anyone. Mm, no one like me. No one like you in that <laughs> show. It's like all like business guys. Business, bu- business oh, dudes. W- well, watch this. Business, business, business. <laughs> business, business, business. Oh, business, oh. business. Oh, money, business, uh, finance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they're all horrible people. So yeah. it's like an insult for me to say any yeah, of them yeah. for you, honestly. Mm-hmm. But... Let me start listing everybody. <laughs> you could be this person. Okay, well, uh, you're definitely not any of the kids. You're not Roman, Shiv, or uh, Kendall. And you're not... Logan Roy. Logan Paul. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you're Logan Paul. That's <laughs> Oh, yeah. Um, maybe, like, Jerry? I'll show you a picture of her later. Like, mm. th- I don't even really know. Yeah. Like, it's, it's tough. There's this is no, not, this is not a no question one, for me. Like, maybe Greg. Mm, Greg. But, like, that's also, that's kind of an insult. Mm, wow. Greg is just, like, a, say this a doofus. <laughs> but I was also going to say Greg for myself. Or, like, yeah. he's just, okay, then, he's in yeah. a position and he doesn't know what to do and mm-hmm. he always says stupid shit. Mm-hmm. And he's like, mm-hmm. 
I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> like business, business, business. Like business, that's business. literally yeah. him. Okay, then that's fine. That's so us. I'll say Greg for us, and then you are like so- a side of Jerry, maybe okay. kind of, just okay. because she's like a girl boss, but girl in boss. like a like I don't know. Yeah, I'm a girl boss. Yeah, you're a girl, I'm boss. A girl boss. I don't know. I um, boss my girl. Okay, good. Yeah. Um, do you have any pets by Maddie Tyler 07? Yes, and he is my son, and he is named Enoki. He's a cat and a little baby. I don't have any pets. I have a lot of plants, and there's a lot of flies that live in the plants. Aww. And I currently have moths in my Aww, yard stash. Yeah, baby. So I have those pets, but no real uh, actual animal pets. I am dog sitting, though. So. Okay, well, that's all we have time for because the sun is setting and I am hungry. And we have to finish our pattern tests that are definitely not due in the next few days. Mm-hmm. But uh, thanks for watching. I hope you liked this. We ended up talking for way too long. So we just got through the questions, but we have hot takes and assumptions. And there's kind of a lot of them that people sent in. So we will either do a whole other video or we'll do like a Patreon podcast. Ooh, yeah. I also have outtakes for this video on Patreon if you want to watch those. Um, I haven't edited this yet, but I'm sure they'll be funny. Yeah. We're because so funny. we're pretty funny. We're so, funny. so that's all. That's Thanks for watching. That's all, folks. Can you try to edit it so like it closes and Oh yeah. And that's all folks.